Welcome back. In this segment, we will discuss systems that can be used by citizens who do not use mobile phones. Ruchi, can you tell us about this? Yeah, sure. I want to uh, tell that in my previous segments, I was talking about how you can use your mobile phone as your bank. Now, I would like to tell that uh, every citizen who has an Aadhaar card, which comprises like 99% of the adult population in India have Aadhaar card. So what you can do is you have to link up your Aadhaar card with your bank account and then you can use the service which is called as the Aadhaar enabled payment system. Very convenient. Uh, also people in the old age or you know people who are not very savvy with the mobile and would not you know not very confident using mobile phone can make use of this Aadhaar enabled payment system. What you have to do is you have to link your Aadhaar card with a bank account, go to a banking correspondent uh, which is available in, uh, in the rural areas or in the cities also. Uh, there's a machine which is called as a micro ATM. You just have to go there, go to the shopkeeper. If you have to pay uh, some amount, you just have to tell your bank account number, your Aadhaar number and uh, your authentication will be done either through your uh, people of the eyes, iris or through the thumb impression. Once you are authenticated, then you can make the payment within seconds. It's very, very simple. Puneet, who are banking correspondents and how can they help us? So banking correspondents are actually bank trained agents who perform uh, financial and banking services. So uh, as we understand currently, there are more than six lakh villages in our, uh, in our country. And uh, even together with the strength of all the banks, all the banks have not been able to reach out to everyone. So the government has uh, launched a scheme where uh, individuals are trained as bank agents just to extend banking services to people. Uh, banking correspondents are certified trained uh, personnel who can uh, give you banking services such as opening an account, uh, doing cash deposit, doing cash withdrawal and doing fund to fund transfer between different bank accounts. So. Uh, these banking correspondents are being launched and rolled out in various parts of the country. Currently, there are almost 1.25 lakh banking correspondents in the country and the number is cons constantly increasing right now. Mudit, how secure is this Aadhaar-enabled payment system? The Aadhaar-enabled payment system is built on the Aadhaar system, which has been designed for safety and it has many safety features and relies on your biometric identification for verification. So as soon as you link a bank account with your Aadhaar number, the security features of the Aadhaar system get transferred to your financial transactions, which makes it extremely secure. The password cannot be protected by you because it's a part of your body and you have to be physically present to have had made that transaction. And the system works with a lot of banking correspondence, as Puneet mentioned, more than a lakh banking correspondence around the country. So the security, and I must mention here that you can, a, a customer can operate the bank account of any bank at the micro ATM or Aadhaar ATM of any other bank. So the system is in, extremely interoperable and the person has to be physically present. And this entire system is built on the safety of the Aadhaar design. That's really helpful. Uh, some people have asked us that if a person has one mobile number, one Aadhaar number, but four to five bank accounts, can he or she link this all together? Yes, so several bank accounts can be linked to one Aadhaar number. And if you are undertaking Aadhaar enabled payments or transactions, you would have to designate one account as the primary one, the default account where you would receive payments or if you choose also make most of your payments from. But several accounts can be linked and used through the same machine. Right, thank you so much for joining us. And in the next segment, we will discuss how uh, technology can enable easy and secure banking. Stay tuned.